They both, um, this is, as you know, in conjunction. And there's Anna and Dottie. Welcome. Hello. Oh, family. <laughs> Thank you. 
walk and talk and kind of just exchange those little sort of glimpses. And that became kind of a commonality. And I think that's what we picked up on in some of these uh, small new drawings of seeing those and, and where that started. And that's sort of the kind of the idea of the parallel. And the parallel is good because um, in terms of this sort of collaboration, it's not really him and I sitting at a piano together and having that sort of right hand, left hand collaborating. It's more back and forth of what he does, what I do, and then talking about it, realizing that the, the template sort of can be transposed. Um, and it worked that way for two years, and sort of had this great idea of um, you would have the ambient, the ambiance of, of the sound within the space. My pieces actually have space within them, and they start to act like a lot of the compositions do. And there's real space, there's real time, and, and the chance of um, these may look very direct, but they're not. <laughs> there is mind control, but they're also very loose in there. They're on a little wild and moving ways um, while they're working on them. So it's kind of left as um, sort of a starting point. And um, over time, we just figured out where this was going to go. Um, I think what we touch on is the live performance, which will happen on Friday. Is sort of setting the tone and setting all the pieces for his piece that started. What you're hearing or will hear is pieces of that that he's kind of worked with. So it's kind of the same thing. I have a base of uh, collection work back there, are small ink drawings that are framed as well. Those are the start. Those are sort of what I started with. And then from them, these come out. So the same thing as the live performance starts. And then he's pulled stuff out and becomes. Um, pieces of that that are just sort of sent into chance relationships. And I think that the, uh, uh, this, this notion of uh, either sort of an iterative process for us sort of internally of ourselves, but also together, of uh, working on something, uh, I'll hesitate to call it a piece, but a thing, and you reach a certain point consideration of that and maybe a shift in the process and then you end up with something that might be another piece or might be the next stage of that piece and I think it's very fascinating for me to, to be in proximity to Rob as he was working to that, that's, that, that's very central to the way I work and then to watch Rob working and seeing uh, not a direct man very strong analogy to that process. I think it would be together. As Rob was saying, the, um, it's not quite a correction, but in terms of the starting point, I, I, I try to think about mapping back to uh, some very romantic art walks through these beautiful fields and these hills, looking out. 